District and communal heating is a method of delivering heat to multiple buildings from a centralized point of generation. These networks may vary anywhere from two buildings sharing a heating system, which is known as a communal heat network, all the way up to larger miles wide networks, which are often referred to as district heating. This is a method of heat used in various countries and actually provides 92% of heat in Iceland. So it's a relatively simple technology. It generates heat in a centralized location and delivers it to connected households. Um, district heat technology has advanced significantly. They can now operate at lower temperatures and deliver heat via low carbon sources, such as heat pumps or lower grade waste heat. Um, for financial viability for heat networks is directly related to heat demand density. Uh, it follows then that the more densely populated areas will be better suited to heat networks. New estates can be set up with heat networks if they are planned in advance and can have the potential to develop incredibly cheap heat and low carbon heat.